Okay, folks, we're back again. We are back again. This time we're going to be working with Alice. She's a five-month five month old German Shepherd. No, no jumping, Alice. That's bad. Bad dog. No jumping. She's a five-month old German Shepherd. Um, off of my litter. She's been here for um, a little over a week now. And uh, we've been working on basic obedience commands. Um, the commands that we've really been working on is her come, Alice. Cause she, she wouldn't come when you would call, but she's been really good at the come command. But now she's um, um, progressing so well, we're actually able to teach her the out command. And that's the command we'll be working on today. Um, the out command is designed to get the dog to leave the thing it loves the most, to stop doing what it wants to do, and to come and to sit at my left. All right? We're going to go ahead and get started with some basic hand and verbal commands. So, once she's, uh, well, we're, just, we're, we're going to just give her a command. Alice, up, 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 around, come around. No, Alice, come around, sit, sit. So, I don't want her sitting here like that. And if I leave it this way, then she'll, she'll continue to do that. No, Alice, come. Around. Sit. Sit. Good girl. One on our left, not off to the side. Doing her own thing. Stay. Give her the stay command. Stay. Around. Sit. Good girl. Stay. Down, around, go, around, sit, down, 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 girl, stay, you want to these drips, no, bad dog, go back over here, huh? oh, no. around, sit, Stay. So that stay command with her was really hard. Coming and sit, sit. I said the word. That's why she, she wanted to C-O-M-E. The stay and the come command was really hard for her. Now she's doing them. Doesn't look, she, of course, like I said, she's only been here a little over a week. It's her second week. And um, she's progressing. But everything's a work of... Uh, work in progress. If you look at her even now, her attention span towards me is much better than it was before. She is normally all over the place and not paying attention to me. Now I have her attention and this is what we want folks. Alice, stop. Good girl. Around. Stay. Now I'm going to prep her food. Her separation anxiety is better. I can actually leave the room without her trying to follow me. Stay. 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 Also, if you've noticed, if you've been paying attention um, to the videos, you notice she actually has distraction now. I had to pull her distraction to get her attention on me. Now she has distraction again. So she is progressing. Now I'm going to go prep her water. Stay.
trying to draw her off of her position. Now, let's hope she'll perform the out command. Alice, out, 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 better up. No, round, round. Alice, out. Bad up, round. Try one more time. Alice, out. Good girl. Sit. Good girl, Alice. Eat. Okay. Folks, says five month old Alice. We're introducing her to the out command. You can see that she's learning that. The, the purpose of that command is to get the dog to lead the thing it wants the most to listen to me. And right now, that is food. So, it's designed so that if the dog is going after something, or if she's even on a sleeve, I can say, oh, she'll stop and come and sit at my left. Thanks for watching, and stay tuned for more videos of Alice and the other dogs. Over and out.